Hello everyone and welcome back to another video. Um, something that I just found out while I was kind of tinkering around my um, my NAS is that um, whenever you install WordPress, which is just you know your regular open source blog, which is included with TrueNAS, and then when you decide to add a <clears throat> a forum feature, which is uh, WP WP forum or I'm not exactly sure exactly if it's pronounced, but it's the the popular uh, plugin for the WordPress forum. And um, the problem that you kind of run into is that it's going to give you a error not found or another error where it just won't be able to display the page. I think I might have figured it out, so I kind of wanted to run it through with you guys just to show you um, the resolution that I came up with. Um, it's really simple. I'm just gonna uh, basically what I'm doing around is I'm, I'm deploying a new jail or a new app, sorry, so that I can reproduce the fault and then show it to you guys and then how to resolve it. And I'm pretty sure that at home um, you could easily reproduce it with TrueNAS um, jail and just make sure that you have uh, the applications uh, running and then deploy uh, sorry deploy uh, WordPress and as soon as this voice I will be able to show you okay so here it is we are going to go ahead and install uh, my site and here we are we are in a completely fresh WordPress de WordPress deployment and now we're gonna go ahead and add a new plugin which is gonna be forum and WP404 so we're gonna go ahead and install that and we're gonna reproduce the form. as you can see it gives us a 404 not found so <clears throat> what I have found to really work well is let's just open a new page so that we can we can have the page available is you have to go under WordPress. I believe it was, yeah, it's under Permal. And you gotta have it as, man, I believe it was month and name. And then it works. It's as simple as that. It's a two minute fix. I'm not exactly sure why it was um, bugging out like that or whatever but when i was looking through the documentation i couldn't really find the um <clears throat> i guess the the documented fix for it but uh this is just a, it's it's really as soon as you change the permalink for wordpress to anything other than host name actually you know what? let's just uh, let's test it out let's go to numeric see if it's still available okay numeric is still let's change it to day and time Day and time is still available, and let's go back to post name. Hmm, okay, interesting. So it still works, it just needs to have it changed once, and then you can go back to your same one. Ah, that's interesting. Okay. I, yeah, I, I don't have an explanation as to why it's broken. Uh, but it is, and it works with changing the permalink making sure that it works and then going back to your old permalink just as a quick verification i did log out and uh, we're just gonna go try and log back in again just to see oh right i did uh well it seems to me that i have locked myself out of the wordpress site but uh i did verify registration works logging in with a separate account also works so it's a pretty self, uh, safe assumption to say that as soon as you change your permalink and then you go back to uh, postname, it will resolve the issue. Alright, thank you for watching this video. See you guys in the next one.